CapCut is always releasing new features on their mobile app, as well as their software for their computer. You always wanna make sure you have the latest version to get the newest, greatest features. In order to make sure you're on the latest and greatest version of CapCut, I'm gonna show you how to do that. From the homepage of CapCut on the computer, you're gonna click this little icon here for settings. Second from the bottom, you're gonna see version. Right now I'm on the 2.60 beta test version. Go ahead and click that. And if you wanna check for updates, click this check for updates button. Now I am on the latest version at this moment, but you can click check for updates. Current is the latest version. So no need for me to update, but if you had an update to install, you could come here and update it. So you're on the newest software. If you are not on the newest version, you will see an install now button. Click on that. And the system will download the newest version for you. Once that's done, you'll see it upgrading. This is the last step. And then you'll have to restart the application in order to see the changes. Now let's go over how to update your CapCut app on your phone. I'm using an iPhone today and I'm opening up the App Store. Type in CapCut and search for the app. You can see here on mine that I have an update available. So the button here says update. I'm going to click on the app. And if I scroll down, you can click on version history to see what and when the updates have been released. I'm going to click back and go back to the top and click the blue button for update. As with any app, you'll see the blue circle populating, and once it's done, the app will be installed on your phone. Okay, the app is done. I'm going to click the blue open button. And now I'm in the newest version of CapCut on the app. If you ever wanna go into the app store to see if you're on the latest version, just go over to the app and you'll see now I can only choose open and there is no update button. So that means you are on the latest version. I would suggest going into your settings on your iPhone to make sure that your apps will automatically download. So you don't have to do these steps. Go into settings and click on the app store and then you'll see an app updates button, which you want to toggle onto green. So it will always update your app to the newest version. I hope you found this video helpful. Subscribe for more.